Hey everybody, welcome back to Smell Good Fragrance Reviews. Today, my favorite house, my number one favorite. I love this brand. Sometimes their stuff is a bit too much, <laughs> but they've brought you some amazing scents that will stand the test of time. If you're into niche, you know exactly who I'm talking about when I talk about this brand. You also clicked on the video, it's like an asshole. I'm trying to be mysterious, but what the hell? So today we come at you with Amouage Bracken Man. This is such an amazing scent. If you've never smelt it, <laughs> I love this stuff. It is to me, it's it's awesome. It's everything I like in fragrance in one bottle. One. The longevity on this thing is nuclear. You'll get 10, 12 hours. 10 on your skin, 12 if you hit your clothes a little bit. All right? Just saying. Before anybody asks, the way I put on my bitch bait, because this is bitch bait worthy. Selling right now. Fat boy here. Got to plow some ass from wearing this. Just saying. All right. Bang on the neck. Bang on the neck. Bang on the chest. Put your clothes on, bang towards the pit area, bang towards the pit area, call it good. All right? That's all you got to do. You will stink up a place, like in a good way. So, let's talk about Bracken Man. One, if you don't like the smell of earth at all, stay away from this. It is going to do you no good. <laughs> you definitely... Get some amazing spices in there, and you you get just this perfect woods, and yes, the smell of wet dirt. It's in there, but it's perfect. I don't know how to explain why it's perfect, but it's perfect. So when you first spray it, you just get hit with a ton of stuff. You get the bergamot, you get the lemon, get the clove and the nutmeg and then you get that greenery from the cypress and you know lavender is in there and that quickly just kind of smooths itself out and you get that cinnamon and cedar wood kind of comes in there it's such a big combination cinnamon and cedar wood you get a little bit of earth uh, a little bit of earthiness from the geranium a little bit of greenery you know and then the base is like a solid patchouli and a little bit of musk but it all holds itself together. This fragrance does not fall apart. It's amazing. And it's nuclear at last. People walk up to you. And the first thing they do is when they walk by you, they go, what the hell? But then they, they catch another smell of you. And then their nose is like taking over going, ah, that's kind of, that's, that smells really good. Then they have to come up to you like, what are you wearing? <laughs> what am I wearing? I'm wearing bitch bait, son. That's what I'm wearing. Bitch bait. Ah, oh, yeah, bitch bait. That's what this is worthy. Bitch bait worthy. You know what I'm saying? Cuba calls it a ball spray. I call it bitch bait. Why? You wear this, women go fucking crazy. And I personally, myself, like the smell of myself when I wear it. That's the first thing. If I don't like the smell of it, I don't care what the women think. Just don't. Not at that point in my life where I'm that desperate that I need to get attention from something I don't like the smell of. Fuck that. This stuff is amazing. Amouage Bracken Man. So good. So good. Atomize is great. The juice. This is my second bottle. And look. I'm going to have it for a little while. So good. So good. So good. So good. But yeah. Definitely. If you want to step into the world of homage and you're like... I don't know about homage. They, everybody talks about the blue bees and they talk about reflection, man. Personally, I think this is better than both of those put together. But that's just my personal preference. I like to smell a little different than everybody else, but I do like to smell good. So, yeah, there you go. Bracket man. It's got a cool little, as you can tell, you probably could tell it's earthy just from the stuff on the bottle, right? Which is kind of cool. You got bracket in there. You can see through the back side of it. You got the insignia on the cap. It's just, they know how to do it and they do it right. You know, so yeah, if you're wondering about getting into niche, 
You want something that smells different? That performs nuclear. You can wear this year round. It's good for everything. You dress up, dress down, chill on the couch, troll your women at your local grocery store because it's fun. Come on, guys. If you've ever done it, you know it's fun because you watch them. They start following you around and what they're doing is not making sense. And you're like, ha <laughs> bitch big word. I'm the Pied Piper of pussy. <laughs> but yeah, Amwaz, Bracken Man. I'd like to get some more Amwaz. Obviously, I have a couple up there, but uh, there's a couple more I want to get. And hopefully I'll find a good deal on some somewhere and I'll, I'll have more of them. <laughs> they're really good. I've had a couple I really don't like because uh, not a rose guy. I use a lot of rose in a lot of their fragrances. But yeah, definitely go check this out. This right here, I can guarantee you, if you want to smell unique, good, and have something that lasts, like nuclear last, there you go. That's what you need. Bracken Man. I'm Wash. Catch you later. Thank you for tuning in again. Smash the like button. Smash the subscribe button. Why not? Right? Trying to do fragrances that not everybody is doing. Obviously, I've been asked to do some because we want the cheapies. Everybody has the usual suspects when it comes to cheapies. Some fragrances are just, they're good. So everybody's going to cover them. And uh, yeah. Put the back, right? <laughs> Later.